Smackdown on Zachary. I really hope this jackass will use protection next time. I hate having everybody see inside my locker. A periodic table. <sighs> Wish I knew what periodic means. Miss Grant is so cool and smart. She defines the word teacher. Hi, Miss Grant. Funny, I was just thinking about you, Max. Thanks again for taking a stand against camera surveillance here. Every signature counts. How is your campaign going? You signed the petition, now it's your campaign too. Thanks for stepping up. More people would rather send a text than sign a petition. That's how they keep us all distracted. Nobody will notice cameras on every square foot. I know. I really hope you keep those cameras from taking over Blackwell. Max, with students like you, we sure will. I'm just thinking about all the autumn photos I want to take. Oh, this is my favorite time of year. I do love the season change. This whole campus is a visual delight. I know Mr. Jefferson loves to shoot around here. You must know Mr. Jefferson pretty well by now. I certainly know him as a talented artist and terrific teacher. I've been here a little longer, but he's made a bigger mark. I have to say, it's not quite autumn enough yet. I can't wait for fall either. It's all about the atmosphere. You're the artist and I'm the scientist, like yin and yang. I'm sorry, Miss Grant, but I have to get going. Go on, Max. We'll talk again. Real soon. Think, big brain. Think. Da Vinci was a boss. I bet if I touch the glass, all these creepy sea critters will pop up. This can't be that hard. Or nothing will happen at all. Brooke always kind of pretends like I'm almost not there. Why? Bring me the brain, Igor. There's Mr. Wizard, hard at work. Hey, Warren. Are you okay? You look thoughtful, yet confused. Maxwell Silver Hammer. Perfect timing. I need help with this chemical experiment. Asking me for help means you're screwed. I have to add either a bit of potassium or sodium. It's up to you to decide, Dr. Max. I'm not sure why you're letting me decide your fate, but... Go... Potassium. Potassium it shall be. If this works, you get a free hug. Weird science. Hi again, Miss Grant. Right back at you, Max. Miss Grant. Can I ask you a possibly dumb science question? You know my stock teacher answer. There are no dumb questions. Ask away. Would you add potassium or sodium to a chemical mix for this week's experiment? Neither. Unless you want a face full of powder. I would add chlorine. I'm sorry, Miss Grant, but I have to get going. Go on, Max. We'll talk again. Real soon.
Hey, Warren. Are you okay? You look thoughtful yet confused. Maxwell Silver Hammer. Perfect timing. I need help with this chemical experiment. Asking me for help means you're screwed. I have to add either a bit of potassium or sodium. It's up to you to decide, Dr. Max. Wrong, Warren. You need to add chlorine. Not potassium or sodium. Chlorine? I didn't think of that. Can't argue with a confident scientist. Let's try it. Eureka! She's got it. No, you got it. Don't be so modest, Dr. Caulfield. Oh, you guys really broke the bounds of science. That was fun helping Warren. He's pretty cute when he's in full-on geek mode. Eureka! He did it. Brooke always kind of pretends like I'm almost not there. Why? Howdy, Brooke. Hi, Max. Making your daily rounds? I'm helping Warren with his latest experiment. Oh, I guess he needed a neophyte assistant so he wouldn't be threatened. But you came to his rescue anyway. Apparently it's my nature. Yet Warren ignores the experts right in front of him. Not that he would ask me for help anyway. 